Some new tech has landed in the F-22 as well as the F-18. The U.S. military is investing in infrared technology. Now, this is something that's been around for quite a while. However, the U.S. military hasn't incorporated it into its fighter jets, and that's the Infrared Search and Track, or ERS systems, boosting the ability to detect and engage air threats without having to rely on radar. This past week, the United States Navy declared initial operating capability, that's IOC, for the ERS Block II, on its F-18 EF Super Hornet. Earths allow pilots to detect enemy aircraft off their heat signatures. This not only increases situational awareness, but also increases survivability in contested environments. In parallel, the United States Air Force awarded Lockheed Martin a $270 million contract two weeks ago to equip the F-22 Raptor with a tactical infrared search and track, the TAC Earth system, which will be upgraded throughout this next year. The TAC Earth is a distributed infrared system within the aircraft collectively known as an infrared defensive system, or ERDS. This not only enhances the F-22's stealth capability, but allows it to detect and engage adversary aircraft. These advances reflect a broader shift in passive detection systems against something that the U.S. military hasn't really focused on in its fighter fleet. This can not only reduce the reliance upon radar, but also can enhance the radar's capability with synergy between these various systems. Stay up to date with military aviation and news by checking out the Lowdown newsletter linked in my bio.